Hi Virgo. <clears throat> have magical blessings whatever you're going through you're being assisted by magical fairy blessings the fairies say you can bless others too so i'm getting like blessings out of nowhere Like you're being blessed, so you've decided to bless others <clears throat> or to bless someone else. You have the High Priestess here. Okay, the Ace of Cups. Eight of Pentacles. Okay. <clears throat> so your intuition is heightened during this time Virgo pay attention to your intuition pay attention to what's going on around you okay you can feel something you can feel something coming towards you or someone coming towards you um, you know that there is a new beginning here for you, okay? Or that someone wants to make you an offer. Someone wants to give you an offer. This is a water sign that wants to make you, that wants to give you an offer or a Capricorn. Zodiac signs don't matter, okay? But this water sign could be a drinker. They could drink a lot or... Virgo, maybe this is you, but someone definitely drinks a lot. They're coming in with an offer. It's like you can feel this person's energy. They're focused on you, but you're focused on yourself. Okay. <clears throat> what is the high priestess? What is the high priestess? All right, the Six of Cups, the Ace of Cups, the Knight of Swords. Yeah, like I said, you know that someone is coming towards you. They're getting ready to reach out to you. They're getting ready to take action. And I feel like it's a Scorpio. This could be a Gemini, Aquarius, Libra. <clears throat> they have something to say to you. Yeah, the Two of Cups. They want a relationship with you. What is the Eight of Pentacles? 
Yeah, Virgo, you're focused on your money. You're focused on your career. You're focused on bettering yourself. You're not focused on this person, but they're focused on you. What is the Eight of Pentacles? So the Five of Cups. Jack Harlow could be significant. The rapper Jack Harlow. Or maybe someone looks like Jack Har uh, Harlow or this could be you. Maybe you favor Jack Harlow. <clears throat> or something is going to come up about Jack Harlow. These are just accusations, okay? But yeah, the Eight of Pentacles, the Five of Cups, the Magician. Someone regrets doing work on you. Someone regrets doing work on you, Virgo. They regret doing magic on you why does this person regret doing magic on virgo or why does virgo regret doing magic on this person i'm picking up something did not turn out the way they expected it to okay or something backfired what is the magician Yeah, the page of swords. So something did not <clears throat> something did not affect you. They wanted this to affect you. They were working on you. It did not affect you. So they do magic and then they watch you to see if the magic is working. Okay. Definitely on your love life or love. <clears throat> Why is this person doing magic on Virgo? Why? Three of Swords. Because they want to hurt you. They want to hurt you. They want to put you in the Three of Swords. Okay. Or this could be another person that's doing this. Maybe they paid this person to do this. But whoever they've paid to do this, they regret it because they've actually looked into your energy or looked into you some way. And it's like they figured out or they found out, they realized that you did not deserve this. You did not deserve this magic. Seven of Swords. Yeah, you did not deserve this. All right, what is the Six of Cups? What is the Six of Cups? Yeah, the devil. This is obsession. This is obsession here. Someone from your past. I feel like it is a Capricorn. Definitely water. They're obsessed with you. This is like black magic, dark magic. Okay. You have the Ten of Cups here. They're obsessed with your happiness. If you show signs of being happy... They want to know why. They want to know why you're happy. 
they feel like you don't deserve to be happy or something like that. This person is strange. They're weird. Because like they're watching you. They can't take their eyes off of you. It's like they're in love with you, but at the same time, they're wishing harm. So like I said, this person is weird. Okay. What is the Knight of Swords? Someone is going to reach out to you while they've been drinking. Yeah, the lovers could be a Gemini. They're going to express to you that they're attracted to you. They find you highly attractive. Okay. Or they want to reach out to you, but they can't. <clears throat> okay. So let's see. One more card. What is the lovers? The lovers. Yeah. Two of cups. The lovers and the two of cups. Yeah, I feel like someone is either drunk texting you or they're just messaging you in general, but they're extremely sensitive. Like someone finds you attractive, like very much attractive. They're very much attracted to you, but it's like, it's like someone is, <clears throat> sorry, it's like someone is focused on the outer appearance they're focused on your outer appearance the way that you look and then I actually see this connection developing into an actual romantic relationship so this person is superficial but I feel like over time things are going to start getting more serious it's almost like they want to be friends with benefits Or this person just finds you highly attractive. Okay. All right. So. <clears throat> yeah. And then you have the three of cups here. You have the three of cups. So. This person is rushing in. They may ask you out on a date. Or can we talk? Can we hang out? Or something like that. But for some reason with the queen with the king of swords here and the queen of swords, I feel like you don't have anything nice to say. Like you don't have anything nice to say to this person. Or you're like, what do you want? What is it that you truly want from me? What do you want from me? Okay. But yeah, I feel like <clears throat> your intuition is accurate. And you can feel this person coming towards you. Okay, Virgo. All right, so yeah, that's all for this message. Okay.